Indie Wonderful with Baton Rouge, Baton Rouge Locals, Locals Only. Only. A weekly half hour exploration and celebration of the music, the people, and the goings on in Baton Rouge. Baton Rouge. Thank you for joining me this Thursday evening. I am still jazzed about this past weekend. Now, most of you know it was Martin Luther King Day this Monday. And if you didn't know, there was also a four day MLK Festival organized by the Walls Project. They're a local nonprofit working on many arts and entrepreneurial initiatives serving as a catalyst for change in this community. Now if you found yourself at any point driving around Baton Rouge just marveling at the street art, chances are the Walls Project had a hand in that. Now prior to this weekend I had never even heard of the concept of a service festival but what the Walls Project did was connect over 150 community organizations and over 4,500 volunteers to get together for planning gardening, blight cleanup, and beautification with artists like Bryson Boutte, Skinny, Mark Fresh, and more, creating uplifting murals all along Windborne Avenue. Now, if you would have told me that cleaning up trash on the side of the road, shoveling debris, or priming a building would be fun, I would have said you are crazy. But actually, it was a total blast. I met so many interesting and dynamic people, had great conversations, and what an absolute absolute privilege to be part of a transformation like that. You can see pictures at facebook.com slash walls project or better yet go ahead and take a drive down Windbourne Avenue. It's beautiful and how cool is it not only to observe Martin Luther King Day but also participate in continuing his legacy by taking action. So we're going to keep that same energy and start this episode with Marcel P. Black featuring snippets of Dr. Martin Luther King with this song, Cry Freedom, right here on Baton Rouge, Baton Rouge Locals, Locals Only. Only. Maybe I could understand the denial of certain basic First Amendment privileges because they haven't committed themselves to that over there. But somewhere I read of the freedom of assembly, somewhere I read of the freedom of speech somewhere i read of the freedom of press somewhere i read that the greatness of america is the right to protest for right cry freedom yo you can't see them coming down my eyes so i gotta make my soul cry i pray the most high let my soul Whenever I'm leaving unto thee and let my soul cry freedom Yo, you can't see them coming down my eyes So I gotta make my soul cry, I pray the most high Let my soul fly whenever I'm leaving unto thee and let my soul cry freedom Yo, I'm Stephen Biko singing for the people Harmonizing and organizing and uprising Through southern ghettos, through South African Soweto's I overstand, it ain't over till the dust settles So I'm Led Zeppelin, rock and rolling with heavy metal A vibe in the instrumentals, I'm flexing with these devils More than a movement, we take it into levels Where well, there is a revolution Gotta find solutions to a world that's good and chop chop like Houston Where the media and the crooked laws of collusion The old present uses messages in the music To the disseminators, was it why he's honest Is the voices of rebellion, I ain't buying what you're selling Feel the pain up in my voice, hit the strain when I'm young the main thing on the tip of my cerebellum rebellion is freedom And I'ma keep speaking until I see it or until I, I feel see it I coming down my eyes, so I gotta make my soul cry I pray the most high, let my soul fly whenever I am leaving unto thee And let my soul cry, freedom, what my people want Tell me what my people need Tell me what we fighting for Tell me what we trying to see I say freedom, man, I really mean it The reason why I sing it, cause my people really need it I'm that turner with a burner Burner at the dome of the new Jim Crow The urgency in my voice is a reflection of my soul Get rid of these conditions, I will take it no more I will chose it just like Moses, go and tell the Pharaoh Let my people go, but you don't hear me though but really, man, I'm tired of asking This is a call to organize so we can get it cracking So never get us free, we gotta make it happen Organize, strategize, and put a plan to action But 
before we see emancipation. We gotta educate ourselves to see some liberation. So right now, with your hand, bruh, is the sound of freedom falling down from my tear duck. Now you can see them coming down my eyes. I just had to let my soul cry. I pray the most high. Let my soul fly whenever I'm leaving. Until then, let my soul cry freedom. What my people want. Tell me what my people need. Tell me what we fighting for. Tell me what we trying to see. And I've seen the promised land. That was Museum Goer from the upcoming EP, Museum Goer 2, out tomorrow, January 25th. That track was titled His First Elevator Ride, and if you like the sound of that, there's a new video for it on YouTube. It's actually inspired by a true story, Alex B. Cook, that you may know as the lead singer of the Rakers, also the mastermind behind Museum Goer, supposedly had a friend in college who hailed from a small town who had never ridden in an elevator before, and when he got to LSU, he rode the elevators in the library up and down for hours fascinated by them now I gotta tell you I love music I don't usually find reading band bios very interesting at all but with museum goer that is not the case he describes the persona of museum goer is that of an impassioned but distant viewer of things they love one with a consuming love which they cannot engage quietly romantic music I very much resonate with that and you can hear more at bandcamp.com slash museum goer check it out this next band was born out of the baton rouge adult music club founded by dave henson the adult music club offers music lessons and camaraderie to adults who are interested in making music people anywhere from their mid 20s to their 60s and beyond the ultimate goal is to give people the skills to start their own groups like this next all-female band of silver foxes this is your mom with Government Center. Well, we got a lot of
is ever gonna get better. So uh, let's rock a rock.
Thank you so much. You are listening to Baton Rouge Locals Only. That was Sleep from Loudness War, recorded live from Warfare 3, a music festival those guys put on at Mid-City Ballroom. Before that, you heard Future Talk with My DeLorean. Up next, we have Drooler by Ben Livingston and Aaron Perez.
Ruler by Ben Livingston and Aaron Perez. We've had a wide variety of music tonight from hip hop to punk rock, experimental and grunge. It is my sincere hope that if you are listening and you ever get the feeling that this town is boring or that there's nothing going on, I hope that you might hear something that makes you think, oh dang, I didn't know that was happening in Baton Rouge. All the interesting things going on might not jump out at you. You might sometimes feel like you have to search for them like a hidden egg on Easter. But I promise you, Baton Rouge has a lot to offer. It is my goal to shine a little light on that each week. We're going to wrap up tonight's episode with some R&B from an artist I just met yesterday. He's a writer, producer, and owner of La Bout It Productions. This is his song, Hold On. Yeah. 
That was Ernest Pollard with Hold On. If you're listening and you have a band or rap group or another experimental project and you'd like to be considered for an upcoming show, get at me on facebook.com slash Baton Rouge Locals Only. Also a great place to hear past episodes and give me a like while you're at it. Catch me next Thursday and every Thursday on Baton Rouge Community Radio, WHYR. Thank you and good night.